This mangled gray pickup is all that's left after a wild chase earlier tonight. It started the day as someone else's everyday vehicle, but suddenly became a getaway truck in a chase that Ariel Vigorito couldn't resist. And we see like probably six or seven cars like come around us and they're, you can tell they're undercover vehicles have like nice new tires and like spotlights on them and stuff. The whole thing started when a would-be forger walked into a check cashing store near 19th Avenue and Bell, but his plan quickly fell apart. He was confronted by police, shots were fired, and that's when he spotted the truck with a woman inside. He pulls out his gun and he sticks the weapon to the young lady's head. At that point, the officers are behind the truck and they can see this. Out of fear for that young lady's life, one of our officers fired one round into the truck and the suspect fell out. At that point, the officers get around to the driver's side and they pull that passenger out and then they realize that there's two very young children sitting in the back of that pickup truck which is why she would not get out of the truck in the first place. They get the kids out at the same time. The suspect gets up, climbs through the driver's side, gets into the truck, and he takes off. From there, the chase was on. The truck continued on its getaway run up I-17, at times driving the wrong way on the access road and onto the high bank sides, trying to avoid capture. And then it was back onto 19th Avenue, where for some reason, he whipped into a busy Circle K, nearly taking out the pumps and several customers before being surrounded. After a brief struggle, he was finally wrestled to the ground, strapped to a gurney, and taken to the hospital. Police not saying tonight whether or not he was shot. Yeah, it was a big boop de doo Everybody was out. I thought it was going to be something worse. Where we're fortunate is that we have no citizens or no officers. Uh, that require any medical care. The suspect has been taken to a local hospital. Uh, I'm being told that he is injured. We don't know how that injury happened at this point.